Okay, here's the next part, the battle at Hulao Gate. I suggest my lord Wan Shao. Yes. All right then. I accept the position of Grand Commander, and I swear to destroy the traitor, Don Zhao. Our allies have begun their attack! I shall accompany you. Alright, as always the intro. The hard-fought struggle against the Yellow Turbans brought peace to the troubled land. However, this peace was short-lived, as the General Dong Zhuo emerged from the Yellow Turban campaign, hoping to seize power for himself. While pretending to serve in the name of the Child Emperor, Dong Zhuo enters the capital of Luoyang, seizing control of the government. With his newfound power and the mighty Lu Bu at his side, Dong Zhuo begins a reign of terror, shaking the imperial institution to its very core. Han loyalists, dissatisfied with Dong Zhuo's abuse of power, rally around young Cao Cao's call to expunge the corrupt leader, raising an alliance to oppose him. With Wan Shao as their leader, an answer to the tyranny of Dong Zhuo is formed. In the year 191, the two forces meet in the lands east of Luoyang. With the strategically vital Fan Shui and Hu Lao gates as a backdrop, the battle for control of the land is once again about to begin. Alright, the equipment's the same, the weapon is the same, the items are going to leave them the way they are, the bodyguards will be sticking at two. The conditions are the same, if Dong Zhuo is defeated, we win, if Yuan Shao is defeated, or if I die, we lose, and it's a game over. Unit info, nothing really has changed. The only additional force that we add to the fact I'm playing as a way officer other than Zhao Dion, I'm playing as Shu Huang. So, South Sao will now have four sub officers and instead of three. And that works as well for any other, uh, any other, uh, general if you play for Wu, if you're not Huang Guy, and Shu if you're not Guan Yu or Zhang Fei. Anyway, we did the intro, so let's do this. Soon Jian, go straight ahead. Cow Cow, go to the top of the Fan Shui Gate. Wan Shu, you attack from the rear. Lu Bei, go around and keep an eye on the Hu Lao Gate. Did you think we would let you through? Wow, it's too early for that. I mean, I didn't even defeat Wong Fong yet.
Alright, now we're gonna go for Lubu. Quickly. I mean, it's been a while since I faced Lubu with only a level 1 weapon. So let's see how it pays out off. Yeah. Yeah, let's see how it pays off. Oh, shh. You dare stand in my way, you pitiful worm. Don't pursue Moo Boo. Go to Hu Lao Gate and attack Dong Zhuo. I, Zhang Liao, will oppose you. Wan Shu's army still has not moved. What? Wan Shu! You have deceived me! I defeated an officer! I shall not die yet! Hey, where's Gao Shun? Oh, there he is. I defeated an officer. Not good. Don't get behind. This is going to take a while. Did he really kill all my bodyguards? Yeah, let's send him over here. He's almost dead. Wow, quit shooting it up. Goodbye. Hold on a second. Wow, so I actually kept the bodyguard alive. I didn't know you were this good of a warrior. Alright, so once you defeat Lu Bu, I said it before, I'll say it again, a supply unit will appear. And that's basically the red hair harness. If you already have the red hair harness, obviously you don't have to go for it again. I'm not going for it, just for the fact that I already have it. Um, we're going to go for the Musa wine now. 
which is on top of the Pond Chewy Gate. You would have to go on this side over here. And there's the Musa wine. Alright, now we're gonna defeat the officers on the other side. Defeat both officers on the side, this gate will open. Now we're gonna go for Wash Young. Or just kill a couple of officers, I mean, troops just for fun. I'll take that. More ointment? Okay, that works. Yeah, I, I know I described to you what some of the items are. I think I, I'm not so sure if I described the ointment. The healing ointment basically recovers everything. Uh, it recovers your health and moves up uh, gauge bar. So. That works. That's probably one of the best items you could find. If you're looking for healing. Uh, so now who are Xiang? Now we're gonna go for a Shu Huang. Shu Rong, I should say. I, it sounds like it says Shu Huang. But yeah, I pronounced that really wrong there, but it's Shu Rong. Yeah, let's secure this gate because the last thing we need is troops storming out like that. Alright, now we're going to go to the bottom and head towards Hulao Gate. Uh, because that's pretty much everything else we can do. I mean, I always ignore the uh, officer on top of the Fan Chui Gate, Fan Chu, and Neo Fu, for two reasons. One, I just don't like going out my way like that. And second, more importantly, or most importantly, uh, bad grammar. 
most importantly, um, I'm playing as Wei, so Sal Sal will kill them off very, very quickly. He'll kill them off really quick, unlike any other time that you'll play for Shu or Wu, because his morale is off the roof, or should be off the roof by now. Yeah, he has a morale of 8, so basically no one can really touch him unless somebody else has a morale of 8. And not only that, you want Shao's force to start to come up a little bit. Uh, so next thing I'm going to do right now is defeat Li Meng. I defeated an officer. Don't get behind. Not this again. All right, good. Something is coming. Forward. Wu Lao Gate is right before us. Watch the Wu Lao Gate. When the gate opens, we will storm the castle. So Hu Lao Gay is fallen and Li Wu should appear right now. But she didn't last that long. I defeated an officer. You dare to be my enemy. Alright, so we're gonna kill off a couple of troops for fun. I mean, if you want to get the thousand KOs and unlock Lu Bu, this is the perfect place to do it. Alright, I'm gonna stop at 500. I always like having around 500 KOs in this battle. Alright, 
Alright, now I'm gonna go to the right wall. Technically, it's the right side of Hulao Gate. And the Dim Sum is over here. So we're gonna gra grab that. And then, uh... We're gonna secure the three gates and defeat Dong Zhuo. Just remember it's on the right side, not the left, because I made that mistake in the past by accident. And you see Lu Jui and Guo Si both appeared. Because, like, in the first 15 minutes of the battle, they will appear. And uh, if you're playing as Cao Cao or playing under Cao Cao's forces, we really have nothing to worry about. He'll kill him off really quick. Alright, that's one gate. There's a second gate. See? He defeated Grossi really quick. Yet another sacrifice to my glory! And there's the third gate. You are a better general than I have heard. Alright, the rest of this battle should be cake. He's almost there. Almost dead. No, no, my plan is all ruined now. And that's a win. Nice. So, let's see how long that took. Took a little over 17, not even 17 minutes. We kept one officer, two officers hanging. One was probably near dead. Two of them could have been as well. Anyway, let's see what we got. I don't think we got anything special when it comes to the weapons or items. Because, what is it? I would pick Muso Max. I like the Muso Charge. Hmm. Muscle Max. And the item, we only had one item and obviously it wasn't promising. Uh, we killed 621 troops, uh, 12 officers killed. So yeah, it wasn't really that bad. We got, we tripled our points for KO. And we actually kept one of my bodyguards alive, which is actually a complete shock, especially when I only have a uh, level 1 weapon. I'll take it. Yeah, 7,000 points again. Not bad. Now we have four sergeants. Make it six. All right, we'll save.
And there you have it. You've been watching my gaming adventures, and I'll see you for the next part. Peace.